a lot of manga artists have varying schedules, but they're all hectic. Artists do not get enough sleep. Now Yazawa says, many manga artists work a whole week with maybe only one day off. Maybe three days to story, one day to writing, one day for penciling, and then one day for inking, which inking just one day, that's a lot. The research here for Masashi Kishimoto, the creator of Naruto, his own schedule. Monday starts with a rough draft based on the storyboard he drew the weekend before. Tuesday finishes the draft and then does the inking in the evening. And I'm assuming this is majority of the chapter and not just like one page. And then Wednesday is submission, meaning that everything should be done by Wednesday. That's crazy. Still no rest Thursday, even though you've submitted because you need a meeting with the editor for the continuation of the story for next week. Friday builds on Thursday, but now you move forward creating the plot and then the storyboards. And then you must finish storyboarding on Saturday so that Sunday, maybe you have a free day. You know how artists are, you procrastinate. I can see some Sundays where it didn't finish on Saturday, so it creeps into Sunday, didn't get any rest. He even talks about how he's gotten sick and even have to be hospitalized at some points. I can relate. His cells were dying. <laughs> All you aspiring manga artists who still want to do it. Now, obviously he got used to it, but even look at the projects of today, he's probably more like a supervisor while other artists kind of pay their dues. Many other manga artists have warned about the schedule. It exacerbated the condition of Gege Akutami, the creator of Jujutsu Kaisen. Some thought it was a 100 meter sprint, only to realize it was a marathon. Just look at the schedule for manga creator Shibashi Hiroshi. He literally has just three hours of free time. That's wild. See this Japanese version, English version, you got room for storyboard, there's room for editor meetings, fixing the storyboards after the editor meetings, colored illustrations, because somebody's got to do those colored covers, volume covers, promotional illustrations, there's room for that here. There's room for sleep, at least it gets some, some sleep, but you can see some of it only getting like five hours. And really you need about eight, right? Five is not the worst in the world, but you need more than that. Only three hours of free time, some writing here and there early Sunday, which I assume is what scenario means. Manuscript stuff, I guess that's working on manga pages. So this is a wild, intimidating schedule. I tried to create my own, but it never stuck because sometimes some stuff just hopped on my plate that I didn't plan for. And then if I had a list like this, then you're going to have to slap on social media here and there, which I just kind of put to the back burner for the past couple of weeks just so I can hit this deadline. But normally I would have to have room for social media to promote the comics because it's not like we have a huge budget to promote the comics. And I want you guys to be able to read what I make. Apple Black Volume 1 to 4, available. Go enjoy. Treat your brain to some goodness. But in order for you to hear that, I need to make videos, TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, and obviously the YouTubes. And I have to promote all the other Saturday AM series because again, we're still really small. And until we have like a huge anime or something like that, or go crazy viral online, this is what's gonna have to be. Or all the YouTube people who talk about manga and anime start to talk about us a little bit more, or honestly at all. Till then, I gotta do it. Luckily, we have been getting bigger. A lot more artists have been writing articles, which I think is really cool, but it's not enough, especially if we're gonna compete. My series, Apple Black, starts with an A. So when you go to the bookshelf and you look for Apple Black, it's right next to Attack on Titan, and the C's for Clock Strikers right next to Chainsaw Man and Oblivion Rouge right next to One Punch Man. So we have to be competitive. And you can't be competitive if nobody knows about you. And then if you're not selling, that's not good. And so I have another video talking about the harsh realities and harsh truths of being a manga artist or an author of any kind in these stores and how cutthroat everything really is. We'd love to hear your thoughts on the whole manga schedule thing after you do a lot of the fun engagement stuff, unless we have beef. Till next time, it's White Manga, and I'm Audi 9000.